Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to create members only sections of your website using web starts. So the first thing you're looking at here is my website and if I click view website I have four pages on my site and I can navigate to any of those pages including this page called videos at the end. Under this videos page are some videos that I set up but I want those to be accessed only by people who sign up and log into my website. So to do that the first step is to add a membership widget to your website and you can do that by clicking on the add icon then finding membership choosing that and you're presented with a question would you like to make this page accessible to members only now I'm currently on my home page and I don't want it to require a username and password in order to be viewed so I'm going to choose the no option and click continue the next question asks you where you would like to send a person to once they've logged in to your website and for this example I'm going to choose that videos page since that's the only page that I'm going to make members only so the next question is how do you want to approve members and there's two ways you can automatically approve members and they can log in right away and have access to that members only page instantly or you can require manual approval of members if you require manual approval you'll get an email notification when somebody attempts to become a member of your site you can then go to your web starts account log in and from the dashboard click on the members tab and then click approve to the right of the members name or the person who's trying to become a members name but for this example I'm just going to choose automatically approve new members and click continue now the next thing you'll see is a question that says would you like to add a member login widget to this page and I'm going to answer yes because I want to have my sign up and login links on the the top of every page of my site so I click finish and now you can see that I have this sign up and login widget added to my page I'm going to change the color so it's uh, completely white and then I'm going to add this actually to the header section of my website and resize it a little bit and I'm going to put it kind of in the middle of my site so from there people can click to log in and become a member of my site uh, or sign up either way well they click sign up to, to become a member and they click log in to log in and see those videos now if you view the live site you'll notice that if I click on videos I still can see the videos and I haven't really protected that yet so in order to protect a particular page you need to go to the page where it says videos double click on the members uh, widget on that page and then change this from would you like to make this page accessible to members only to yes from no and then click continue and then go ahead and answer the other questions just like you did before so we do want to have a membership widget on this page but since we already have one it asked me if I want to add another I say no once I'm through the wizard I click save and now when I go to that page it requires my login which I've already created and once I'm logged into that page you'll see it indicates that I'm logged in and how I can log out using this link here once I'm logged it out of course I again will not be able to have access to that page your users can go back at any time by clicking go back and if they click sign up this is how they sign up so hopefully all that made sense to you don't forget to visit webstarts.com to create your very own free website and also see more helpful videos like this and if you ever have a question feel free to email support at webstarts.com